When my grandmother was a little girl, they were sharecroppers, and there were four kids, and they didn't, my great-grandmother Leela didn't have any money to actually buy Christmas gifts, and so instead she would squirrel away ingredients all year long, a little bit extra sugar here, some raisins there, maybe some dried apples left over from the fall harvest, and on Christmas Eve, they would go to bed, and she would stay up all night making seven different cakes for them, one for each day up until the new year. She never had a recipe, and they would all be different cakes. One might have raisins in the filling, one might have some apples used in the frosting. It was all seven entirely different recipes just made up off the top of her head. And she would stay up all night doing it and lay them all out on the kitchen table. And first thing Christmas morning, Grandma and her sister and two brothers would come out in there, all excited on Christmas morning, knowing that those seven cakes were gonna be there. And even now, my grandmother still talks about that with stars in her eyes. And so that's the thing that I wish most for you for Christmas, <laughs> is that you can wake up with the joy in your heart and the wonder that those kids had at seeing those seven cakes on Christmas morning.